Commander. Hey everybody, welcome back to XCOM. This is Operation Senseless Tears. We are max infiltration right now. 250%. Uh, we've gained the Shadow Squad ability, so everyone's going to get a single charge of conceal. Joke's on us, though. Uh, if the Hunter is here, which he is presumed, he's going to reveal us anyway, so... I don't know if that's going to work out that well. What is nice is we've got uh, Opportune Moment 2. So we're getting a plus 10% crit across the board, which is great. We're also getting plus 15 dodge. We removed uh, the negative sit rep, which was about reinforcements, I believe. So there is hope. There is hope. And we have a decent squad. Uh, assault infantry, assault infantry uh, to try and deal with the hunter up close if possible uh gentle is here on her own do we have any other bonds here thomas Steele, dro is with prohatska and ace is with daniel so no nope, no bonds uh great planning commander as always let's rock and roll shall we ace cuttlefish dro hunter gentle and ostergard ready to a rumble we need a scientist we've been getting alerts saying guys we need scientists here and i'm like i'm trying i'm trying my best Today's log comes from Nikolai, who writes for Liu Short Fuse Chen. Now, if you haven't been uh, paying attention to the logs, there's a little, there's a little bit of a, uh, there's some love in the air at the base amid all this craziness. Okay, so they say, I ran into Tyrant and Marie in the hallway outside the bar. They were holding hands. Tyrant just gave me a look, and Marie blushed and looked away. It's nice to see that in all this death and destruction, we're constantly surrounded. By does not rob us of our humanity and feelings for one another. For I'm happy for the two of them. God, you know, it'd be a real shame if something happened to one of them. <laughs> it would be a real shame. <laughs> I really hope not. People will revolt. People will revolt. I'm going to do my best, guys. Keep the love in the air. Keep the love in the air. Menace one five, target coordinates. Okay, incoming. now secure um, the VIP and proceed to the evac volume for extraction. We didn't have the ability to equip a skull jack. Already knows we're here because this was an infiltration mission. Concealed for the extraction. So yeah, that being said, um, we will not be able to do that. However, uh, Dro is phantomed up, which is nice. Everybody does or should have that conceal. I'm not going to use it yet. Um, where's our extraction? It is on a roof somewhere. Let's start Close here with Dro. Looks like hot sounds over here. Oh, okay. Well, there's our officer. Now, I guess that's the thing is we're gonna we're gonna see a bunch of these officers for a bit until we skulljack one, which will maybe be on our next mission, if at all possible. Uh. I think here is technically safer, but I don't know what's beyond. Rowing. As a hostile patrol. Oh, traditional snake. Yes. Now we're talking. Uh, gentle. Take this. No. Oh, they're not. Ah! They're not. They're not concealed. We just looked at it, man. Oh my. God. God, what the actual F is going on? How could you? Advent Shield Bearer. This is our first one that we've seen, actually. Um, <laughs> I think we can get out of this. But that is a pretty unfortunate goofball move. Close. Look, I want to say that this is probably better. Uh, I do have an issue in that the shield bearer will have flank ability, but we'll have the high ground against the snake, which I need. Uh, we've got 11 health on Hunter. Location confirmed. It is a shotgun, so... <laughs> oh, what a, what a horrible opener. I really don't want to have to burn my axe here. Beautiful start. Beautiful start. Um, 
I think I'm running and gunning this as well. Let's go for the snake. He can move. Actually, I could probably take the half cover here. My only concern is maybe triggering that group that's up top. And I, I do like the height advantage. I'm going to take one tile in just in case that guy does decide to move back a little bit. Potentially, we break vision there. I could also uh, prep for entry. Actually, I, even if I prep for entry, I won't have the range because it's 50% uh, reduced. Okay, beautiful job from the assaults, uh, making up for my uh, totally BS error. <laughs> I don't know what my thought process was there. It was, oh, they have concealment, obviously. Okay, well, here comes the suppression. And probably just an aid protocol on our boys on the roof. I'm going to take this. It's not the sexiest move, but... Uh, we're on many bullets, 33. I'm good with that. Come on, poke your head out. And these guys will both benefit. And then uh, Shara Vengeful Nikamoru. Bunker it down. And there he is. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, 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 right cool, cool. cool. Priests, concealed units, brittle Templars. I appreciate that. Nice to see you again, my friend. It's been a while. One of the chosen is here. Oh, that was a 50% chance. Not bad. Yeah, that's the best. That's the best thing he could do. I think. Probably should have hunkered down, but. We're seeing this because of Dro. Oh, another traditional snake. I have eyes on the enemy. With a pathfinder. Okay, great. Bring it on, I suppose. Are you joking me? That's full cover. It's burning on. Delicate. How'd you ever last this long? You really think you could hide from me? Alright. Um These guys are down below, which is nice. Can I get oh I can I can get to this corner. That is a nasty little corner as well. Um I might choose this one instead, only because of the the possible visual through here. Um It's not going to be easy, though. Grappling. And it's very easy for us to get pulled from that snake. So I got I got shots pretty much anywhere we want them here. Plus a frostbite, which maybe we'll need to use. Um, I, I do fancy a nice little zone suppression here, actually. We have them all in vision. I won't be able to hit all of them, but I could hit three, which is going to disorient there. Um, yeah. That shield bearer is a bit of a problem. He's just... He's just so far. There's only what one Overwatch? That shield bearer. We could break it with disruption field. I feel like that's definitely a bit overkill. Hmm. 
what are we going to do? These guys got to move up. Um, he is disoriented as well, so I, I'm not super concerned about this. Uh, do I have the moving away ability? No. He's only a, a young, a young corporal. Uh, Pierce does have it though. Breakthrough. This is all we can hit. I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna go for it. Yeah, that was. That's pretty low chances. Nice job. Nice job. That's great. That's all. That's what we needed. A absolutely. And then you can take this full cover here. I like that. I like that a lot. Then uh, Ostergaard, I think we come up to full cover here. And we can get that one shot kill on that Pathfinder. Because F those guys. See you later. You know, that was good. Uh, let's put Vengeful here in full. Cuttlefish, I would I would actually like to get up top here. Might not be possible. I think we drop another suppression on that shield bearer. On my way. And then we do a, a zone suppression on this group. Uh, she hasn't moved, so we could do a shot. 53. Okay. So that little error that shows up there, um, we can confirm that based on the shot that we missed, 100% shot in that lost mission uh, last episode, it is, it is, the shots are being calculated based on our original aim, but that little extended information flag that pops up is probably not accounting for something in some way. Uh, but these shots that we hover on our original, that's definitely correct. So just in case you're wondering why that happens sometimes. I think we just suppress there and then ace, I don't know. I can maybe just come up into full here, but maybe, I, maybe we take this. We actually don't even need full technically. But maybe we just get in closer. Copy. Suppress that. This would be a, a kill if it lands. And then I don't even need a, a zone suppression. I just need to suppress the snake. This is a really good shot too, but this is a kill. If it lands, which it will. Yeah, baby. Now I could I can reconceal him next, which I probably will do. I haven't seen this. This is so weird to see this. It's been a long time. Oh boy. Advent troops here. Advent spark, bio assault. Okay, this is this is gonna be sweaty. I see a zone suppression in my future. Hunter is marked. And there's that group from the left side. Derelict there. Oh, no, don't climb it. Oh, Dro. Okay, we might be okay. Yeah, F that wall in particular. Good thing he didn't put that shield up uh, now. Oh, he's coming right in, too. There's no to well, you can be sure we're going to be moving. Yeah. I do like this. I, I do like this. We have a guaranteed, guaranteed shutdown. Uh, or I have a guaranteed kill. Uh, or if I want to get real spicy, 
we we fail safe this and we try to control it which then gives us like a roaming mimic beacon that would be my preferred method but it's not i mean if we're, it's going to be over 70 percent which is pretty good i think it'll be over 70. let's let's take a look fail safe yeah 72. <sighs> That would be my preferred method, definitely. Um, oh, if this fails, though, then I could have had the shutdown or the kill, right? I'm going to feel really bad about that. We'll come back to it in a second. Uh, Dro, we're definitely moving. We're definitely out of here. This gives me the flank on that bio trooper. And we can use our snapshot to fire that. I should maybe just drop back here to be safe. Safe-ish. Because this derelict is going to prime and run at us, right? almost wonder if I should try and deal with him somehow. What's my shot on the derelict? Oh, it's actually quite good. Tracer round, sniper scope, steady aim plus five. So we're going to lose that. And we might lose some, some, uh, we might lose some aim if we move in this close. I think it's worth trying. 88 still pretty good. Come on, Dro. <sighs> well. That's problematic now. That is very problematic now. Because if he blows up, Dro falls, Dro's gonna die, definitely. And I can't count that protocol up there. Do I have any possible way of dealing with that? Oh, no. Oh, that is bad news bears right there. That is really bad. That's really not good, guys. It's gonna hurt. He might be dead. That's a that is a incredible whiff. <laughs> Let's think about this. What could I possibly do here? Had I not fail safed this, actually I I could have come up to here. But then I still don't even have the visual of that derelict. Okay. We do have some med kits around. If I bring Pierce in to kill this trooper, and then he comes back and takes, like, you know, half cover at least, that's something. Um... We do like a, a big area suppression on on both of these guys, I think. I move Cuttlefish up if possible. Ostergaard definitely moves somewhere. I might even uh might even frost somebody from Hunter's position. Maybe the shield bearer kind of feels useless, maybe the Pathfinder, but let's start here. Uh, I'm, I'm worried for Dro. Gas grenade, okay, thank you. How many is that now? Don't worry about them. 
The elders have plenty more to spare. Let's just, let's just close the door. Because <laughs> you never know. It is clear. Ostergaard. This spark. Whatever you say. I think I need to. I think I do need to kill it now. What kind of abilities does he have? Prime self destruct. Damn. If I'm going to shut it down, I might as well kill it. So the question is, do I try and take control? We just failed a, an, like an 80-something shot. There's no cover here. I can take half cover, which I might have to do. That gives me vision of three. Fewer if I kill that mech. Let's start with this. Um, okay. Fifty threes across the board. You know what? I'm actually just going to reload, get full ammo, and we're going to zone suppress. I think these two are these three. Do we have... Oh, yeah, we... Well, one, two... I don't actually have visual of this uh, bio-assault. I guess. So this is where something like that emplaced could come in. Where you get that extra um, visual range. Like Olivia has. Plus 10 aim and a weapon range increase of 5 plus tiles. So... I, you know what? Maybe instead of moving up, I do the same thing here, and I just do this group. This bio assault definitely survives, or like definitely doesn't get suppressed. We have the advanced officer over here. I could be flushing here as well. Ready to engage. I think we need to focus on on surviving this round. We still have ten turns. Ostergaard. Oh, man, that sucks. I think I'm going to hold that. These are low percentages. You know what? I'm going to hunker here. In position. I'm going to hunker that. Oh, wow. That looked like it the chances of that landing, very low, even though we're in half cover. Oh, my God. Suppression's both removed. Oh, I am very concerned. Oh, they just don't stop. Are you kidding me? This is pretty wild. If we get a mind control here, we're in big trouble. Oh no! We are in for it. Wow. They might seem mindless, but they still hit pretty hard, right? Smells like fresh blood to me.
Okay, I always forget that they don't do the prime and the attack on the same turn. Okay, now we need to figure this out, and this is not looking pretty. I'm looking for Sectoid, but he's got 16 health. There's no way I kill this. Running Gun is on cooldown. I don't have... Well, hold on a second. Okay, so he's disoriented, so I can't use his his blinding protocol, which really sucks. I do wonder if I could disorient that sectoid commander. I mean, this guy is definitely going to blow me up next time. And she's disoriented, so she can't heal and or move anywhere. Holy smokes. <laughs> I don't know what the play is, you guys. I'm not sure that there is one. There's just so many enemies. There's so there's I keep, there's so many. So, look, I've got I've got a point blank, which is, you know, good, but I still can't kill that guy. I can't evac. I got overwatches down here. I made the comment about something happening to Gentle and it, the prophecy is coming true. I don't see a way out of this. I just don't see it. Um, I could hunker her down, give her the best chance, but Ostergaard's gonna go for her. The bio assault's gonna go for her. Um, there's no way that I can move anywhere that's gonna save her. This is derelict mech, Pathfinder, Sectoids, mechs. It's all half cover here. I don't think I can fire my sawed off as a second shot, right? Jeez. All right. Um, what's the play? Die zombie. I think what I need to do is I need to at least come outside. I need to ax something. Anything killable? Probably not. This guy has so much armor. Jeez. 
Jeez. I kind of have to try here. Did that hit? It, oh my god. We whiffed that as well? Are you joking me? This is crazy. Good crit. If that would have landed, this would be one dead Pathfinder. Oh my god. And there's just... I can't even move far enough away. What the actual F. Oh, I can go here. I mean, we have the close quarters thing that might help us, but I mean, we're just super flankable. Derelict mech coming in for an explosion. What's over there? A still can't fit there. We do have this. God. I've got half cover here. Guys, we <laughs> we might we honestly might squad wipe here. That's my concern. I need to freeze this guy. That's all I got. All right, we landed that. So that's that's positive. So he's going to blow up there. And I need to like Come way back here. Roger that. <sighs> gentle, gentle, gentle. This is bad. This is a really, really bad scenario to be in. This is a really bad scenario. We're just, we're so flankable from everywhere. My zone suppression's on cooldown. I don't have any, like, uh, arc throwers to stun Ostergaard. I can't conceal because we are... Um, it says because we're flanked. Ooh, you know what? I wonder... Okay, this is flanked from the Pathfinder. I thought we couldn't conceal because of the uh, disorientation. Okay. See, I can do it here. It's a free action. The, 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 <laughs> the problem is I don't have a spot to go where she's not flanked. She's flanked here by the Pathfinder. She's flanked here by the Pathfinder. Here. Here, she's flanked by the Bio Assault. Maybe here, actually. Yeah, disoriented. F. Okay, well. <sighs> That's what I thought. That's what I thought. 
What are we going to do? What are we going to do with this? I think I just have to move back. Create a little bit of space. And... Sure thing. Try to... Disorient some stuff. We're gonna hunker here. Hunker here. And then Ace literally can't do anything. He can break this overwatch, which I'm gonna try. And we're sitting in half, which is full for him. Oh, he is one health. Go on already. Kill all the humans. We're two health. Ah, uh, Ace is gone. And he's probably just the start. That's good. This could hurt. Wow. 97 miss. Wow. Okay, Hunter. Okay. This probably just goes for gentle. Oh, he's suppressing. Just hunker down. Okay. Oh, she's gone. Oh, the frozen. Oh, okay. Okay. That might have saved her. Maybe he's thinking ahead somehow. Found row. You can't run and you can't hide. I think he's gonna lose his mind control soon. This guy's still frozen. Psy zombie, I'm concerned. Now, keep in mind, too, we have that, we have the Templar card where if you uh, go down, you should have a higher chance of bleeding out. That did not kick in. <laughs> that did not happen. God, I just wish I could shoot multiple times there. We are suppressed. a shield bearer flank scenario here. We only have a 60% because of that suppression. <sighs> okay. I have no choice either. That's the worst part about all of this. I don't have a choice whether to fight or not. I can't evac. Now, if I come up here, uh, unlikely flanks from this position, they could obviously come up here and flank, but I would get a decent shot in that bio assault. Not a problem. Maybe some shredding. Honestly, 
But then he's just super dangled. Um, if I run from here, does that officer see me? He actually doesn't. I don't know what he's overwatching against here. Th this is the issue, is this advent mech. What I'm wondering is if I come up... If I come and break concealment somewhere... And then... Or sorry, if I break his suppression... Is my aim going to be better? Or does it persist after I break it? I think it might... I gotta go for it. Oh, the snake too. Didn't even see him. Here comes the suppression overwatch. There we go. Something. You better step up your game, Commander. Yeah, okay, so we break it and then we get to at least have this. Um if I take this shot, five to six, chance to crit. It's not gonna do it for me. I might as well slash. And then I have the option to reposition somewhere down here in half cover. The shield bearer comes and destroys me, I think. I can come down here and still have a shot on a couple of the things that we need. I would like to kill this Pathfinder. Maybe I come from here. God. Come on, Dro. Oh my Not god. I don't I don't I don't see any like redeeming qualities here. I, I don't I don't know how we deal with this at all. The crazy thing is, is that this this mech, once he unfreezes, he's going to come down here and hit Hunter, right? Um, if I were to switch to this side, I have mech, uh, sectoid flanks there. My best thing is to literally stay in this position and hope for the best. And it's there's no best here. Let's get it on. He's gone for sure. They won't hold up long at this rate, Commander. Wow. I'm all right. I have to I have to assume Hunter's dead. This could be, uh, this is a big setback. I don't know what we could do here. Not complaining. 
Enjoy these final breaths. Wow. Okay. I don't even know what happened to Cuttlefish here. Wait, what what did happen here? Okay, Ostergard. Oh, Ostergard must have come and done an attack. I don't know if I blacked out there. You guys, we we squad wiped here. We're squad wiping for sure. There's literally like nothing I can do. This is insane. So, our initial mistake here, obviously revealing with uh, uh, Gentle, I think. We could have handled that group, that's fine. But the swarm that came after, the mind control. Uh, oh my god, dudes. Holy f is there a way I can save Ostergaard here? The worst part, too, is like we're losing the Viper suit. We're losing some weapon upgrades. Uh, the Frost Bomb. I honestly don't know what to do. I don't know what to do here. Try and cause a distraction with the VIP. Because this, I can't kill, I can't beat this. <laughs> I don't know what to do to try and survive here. I'm going. I'll try and conceal, but the, the hunter is going to reveal me at some point. The VIP is down. Move to rendezvous with Firebrand for extraction. This is just too easy. Yeah, you say that now. That's a, that's a full squad wipe, man. I don't know if we've ever had one of these before. This is, uh, holy smokes, crazy. Bio Assault's gonna come in and stab him. Oh, of course, of course. I don't know. I don't know, man. I can see further than you think. Did they flank him here? Uh, 
Um, if I heal, then I can only blue move, and then I'm going to be have more overwatches. This is my only weird hope. and girls avenger all XCOM operatives are dead or mia i'm returning to base wow <laughs> i am in disbelief right now we got just swarmed and we missed some crucial shots. That Our onslaught of enemies in the middle the there just of the old whoa. World. Forget the violence. We lost the some good gear the too. Needless death. But we of Advent do not forget. That we is remember. That is a rough one. We ensure that it will never happen again. We prevail. That's a, a man. Talk about a setback. Ho oh, ho ho, man. Is that ever a problem? The engineers are dedicated to making sure this doesn't happen again. <laughs> we'll do everything we can. Holy. Gentle Ace, Hunter, Cuttlefish, Dro, and Ostergaard. Gone. If anything. I fear we are making it easy. An ace with his big, ugly pauldrons. I didn't even get to fix them. Man. Never reveal yourself when you don't have a safe escape. We oh, thanks, Volk. Thanks, Volk. That's very encouraging in this time of need. Okay. I'm not, I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up. At all. At all. Uh, we're gonna be filling this, this guerrilla tactics as much as I can. Uh, any type of like rescue mission out here, um, we need to be doing it. I was planning on doing that mission then Coming to rescue these stranded agents over here with that gear. God, does that ever make this look much better? It's one agent. And it's lost. Man. I'm going to take my lowest rank guys here. Mind you, I'm going to need to bring almost all of them. I'll bring Tyrant because of the pistol. <laughs> wow, did we ever just get clobbered? Take prototype here. Predator. I can't really go the scavenged here. So you know what? We'll put scavenged on tyrant actually. Anti-material rifle, and we're gonna take a pistol. We'll take the Shadow Keeper, I think. Wait. Three to five versus four. Yeah, I think we'll take the four. I think that's better. K15 there. 
shard gun. I actually thinking maybe not everybody, like not both of our sappers using shards here. Just a little bit of extra range against the uh, the lost horde. Mag rifle there. Oh god. Where are we? Okay. God, we lost like, we lost so much. That is just a absolutely massive setback. That's unbelievable. Mobility and bipod. Okay, so we're going to switch the frame or uh, the bipod. Oh, hold on. Wait, can I not use that on this? Oh, I'm, oh, I read it wrong. Never mind, never mind. Never mind. I thought it was the reload one. This experimental mag, for some reason, always throws me off. So bipod and... Let's go lightweight frame back to what it was. Mag rifle. Yeah, you can take a basic bipod there too. Bedded stock. Do something similar over here. And then we'll put the... We got wildcats there already. Maybe instead of the bipod, we'll take the wildcats on the sniper. And I think that's going to be about it. Yeah. Well, uh, that's a big that's a, the biggest setback we've ever had in any campaign ever. Um There's not much I can do. We do have some stuff. There is some there there are AP rounds that we found somewhere that we can use. Um Five, ignoring five rounds of armor is actually really good. You know what? I'm going to get rid of this. I'm going to go back to Kevlar here. I'm going to give you AP rounds. Uh, I'm going to give you tracers. I'll give you AP as well. You have Sentinel, right? Yeah. We could take the Skulljack, although it just says it's Horde here. Vest. Vest. Do we have any field medics? Yeah, my bad. I have two. We lost a bunch of our med kits, I think, too. Oh, okay. Can we leave it like this. I mean, it's a lot of grenades. I'm going to try not to use them if it's just lost. Shadow Keeper here. Do I have a better... I think we have a mag pistol, don't we? Oh, maybe not. I think that would be worth building here. Oh, it's the same as the rail. It's the same as the rail. They have the small caliber. 
This one doesn't have a small caliber, right? Doesn't suffer penalties against armor like other pistols. The Shadow Keep cannot benefit from equipped ammo items. Oh, so he can't benefit from AP rounds. That's pretty smart. Okay, well, in that case, we'll take the rail pistol. Arc thrower here. Advanced. We're not giving up. We're not giving up, but it's going to be very difficult to come back from that. The good news is they weren't the highest ranking soldiers we have. Uh, the bad news is they're right in that middle ground, and... Yeah, that is a major issue. <laughs> Wish me luck, guys. Now I'm seriously going to need it. Bye for now.